Hey guys, it's Devin, and today I'll be giving you my review and top five moments of episode five of Constantine, Don's Voodoo. So let's So in my up. opinion, I would have to say that episode five of Constantine was a B plus. The episode picks up showing Team Constantine trying to find a new location to go to. They somehow then decide to go to New Orleans and check out the rumors of ghosts going on a killing spree. We get to see Papa Midnight again, helping out people by doing spells to, you know, talk to their loved ones again, but is getting paid to do so. And however, he doesn't realize that his spells aren't going exactly as planned because with the help of the loved ones that he's trying to help, he's accidentally bringing the dead spirits back to life and kind of allowing them to go on a killing spree, which now has to make an unlikely alliance because Midnight has to recruit the help of Constantine to help put these spirits back into their resting grounds. While, you know, that unlikely duel has to work together, we get introduced to Jim Corrigan, who is a detective on the show who's going to be helping Team Constantine. Jim Corrigan is a major person in the Constantine mythos in DC, in DC Comics. He's been around since the 1940s. But in the episode, we get to see him helping out Team Constantine. And as he helps Team Constantine out, he starts to realize that he knows one of the people from the group. And he does. He knows. He remembers Zed. He gives us a little insight on Zed's backstory in her past and talks about things that Zed's been trying to keep a secret. What he was saying really made me wonder even more about when we will learn more about Zed Martin and what she's trying to keep a secret, you know, what she's really doing. And what was she doing before she met Constantine? I I wonder, do you guys wonder as well? I like Zed Martin. Hopefully she doesn't, you know, end up being someone bad who's going to do Constantine dirty in the end. But and now for the spoiler warnings for the people who haven't seen the episode just yet. I'll give you a moment to skip ahead into the video to where you see my face again. And that'll be your okay to watch the video so you haven't spoiled anything for yourself. So are you guys ready? I'll give you a moment. Okay. And now for the top five moments of episode five of Constantine, Don's Voodoo. Moment number five, Constantine smokes his first cigarette on the show. This is big because a big part of his mythos is him just chain smoking. Moment number four, say hello to Jim Corrigan, and he helps Team Constantine. Moment number three, Papa Midnight and Constantine work together and do a spell to put the ghost back to rest. Moment number two, Zed's backstory is kind of revealed, and Zed has a vision of Jim Corrigan becoming the Spectre. Moment number one, Papa Midnight's sister has a message to tell Constantine that someone will betray him for the coming well, darkness. There goes my review of Constantine episode five. I hope you guys liked the video. And if you did, please give us a thumbs up. And if you're new to our channel, hit the subscribe button down below for more videos on anything comic book related and your favorite comic book TV shows. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Also, what do you guys think of Zed's vision of Corrigan becoming a Spectre? Were you excited about it? And how long do you think it will be before we see the Spectre and other magic beings appear on the show?